Listen, I know you guys are worried about me right now, okay? <laughs> All right, here's what I was gonna say. <laughs> when your wives leave you, don't get on Tinder and get off of Facebook. Get off of it. You have to delete the app. You, have to get, you cannot have it on your phone, laptop, anything. It's too painful. All of your memories are on Facebook. Did you know that? Every single memory you've ever made is on Facebook and Facebook will not stop reminding you about it. Do you know where I start every day? Every single day at 8 a.m., Facebook sends me a little notification that's like, what's up, man? Wanna see what you and your wife were doing four years ago today? <laughs> you know that I do, Facebook. I wasn't getting out of bed today. Let's do it, show me what you got, man. But you can't, you can't put yourself through that. It's too rough. You're like, worse than that, like worse than your is hers. Like I could, I could go to her face, like before she blocked me or whatever. Uh, <laughs> it happens, it happens. It's the temptation is too great, I dare you. I, you. I could go to her Facebook and I could just scroll all day long through eight years of memories. I could just scroll through eight years of posts and photographs and I could comment on every single one of them. <laughs> uh, which I did one Father's Day. <laughs> I wasn't planning on it, it's just, I got, I scrolled too deep. That's why you shouldn't, you get too deep and you get too sad and there was a photo that was just too cute and I couldn't help myself. It starts out small, it starts out so small. I just left a little comment that said, oh my God, look how much younger and married we used to be. Enter. <laughs> Now, if you know how Facebook works, that is now at the top of her timeline and all of our friends' timelines. <laughs> Just like Aaron bitterly commented on a post from 2011. <laughs> <laughs> so I figure once you do one, you might as well do them all. You're getting, you're getting blocked regardless. It's, the levy broke, so I... There was one, there's just, I'm not, well, uh, I always say that I'm not proud of it, but the truth is there's this one that I'm actually really proud of. <laughs> but like, for the most part, I agree, this was a very immature and reckless display, but that one was really clever. <laughs> there was this picture, she was in half of it, like she was kind of stepping into the frame, and she was cut off by the edge of the photograph, and I wrote, fun fact, Tabitha only has one foot in this photo because the other one was already out the door. <laughs> That one felt good. <laughs> that one felt so good. Uh, it was about this time that Brittany, her sister, sent me a message. She sent me, she sent me a direct Facebook message. Um, I mean, I think, I think it was her. Uh, it could have been Todd, because they share one Facebook, you guys. <laughs> one. You don't know who's talking to you. You don't know whose birthday it is. <laughs> anyway, he or she, one of them said to me, this isn't funny. And I wrote back, are you sure? <laughs> I put LOL on a couple of them. Uh, well, that made it pretty clear. <laughs> I'm kind of the comedian here. Uh, maybe we'll defer to my judgment. <laughs> I don't tell you how to not sell Scentsy candles.
Anyway, then Brittany Todd sends another message and says, this isn't healthy. You think? <laughs> you think I didn't know that yet? <laughs> you think you were the first person to tell me that today? Get in line, Brit. Everyone is worried about me, all right? <laughs> Friends, family, all of these people. <laughs> everyone. I'm having a very public meltdown right now. <laughs> These messages have been coming in all day, all right? Aaron, that's not healthy. Aaron, that's, Aaron, this is unhealthy. I know, uh, but I am, un do you understand that I, divorce is unhealthy. My hair's falling out. I have had unexplained diarrhea for three weeks straight. <laughs> I know how unhealthy I am. Would you, would you give me a break? <laughs> would you please, if you could see into my, into my mind the list of unhealthy things that I feel like doing right now, you would realize that sending friend requests to the guy she's been on dates with. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> I'm doing pretty well. <laughs> 